Hi, I'm Chad Hubner. And I'm Sarah Hubner with the Diner Realty. And today we are going to be talking about an end of summer and early fall market update. So let's talk first off about what a normal market is or market normalcy. Um, and this year in 2021, we've kind of seen it, um, especially in the summer. Right after school ended, it kind of slowed down a bit, which we normally see. Um, picks up again in late June, right after 4th of July. And then it slows down again once we get towards school starting in Labor Day. And we've kind of seen that this year in 2021, which has been kind of nice. Um, 2020, as you remember, we didn't see that at all. Um, things were just kind of gangbusters all year and more of an abnormal market mm -hmm. market conditions. And you may be wondering, why would it slow down in early June when school lets out? Wouldn't that be when it's gearing up? Well, this year in particular is that first summer that we've had after a full year of COVID and everything being shut down, sports being um, halted. Um, now we're seeing that those activities resume. And so with that, families were busy with those activities temporarily. And once those routines were settled in, they got back into the, the house search mode. Yeah, I think vacations were big too. Vacations, yes, were also big this year. And so you may be wondering, how does that translate into pricing? And are we still seeing a lot of multiple offers out there? Pricing has certainly been interesting with the increase in the multiple offers that we saw early in the spring. What it ultimately did is it set the bar higher for those sellers coming in the summer months that are now looking at pricing their home for a summer and fall market. What they're doing is going in back and looking at the spring closings and saying, where did these properties sell? And then they're adjusting their list price accordingly. What we are seeing is a little bit of normalizing of the market where instead of maybe seeing 15 or 20 offers on a house, we're still seeing some multiple offers, but it might just be two or even three. Um, or we're seeing one offer, but it's a really good offer. So that is now what we are seeing as we are moving from the late summer into the early fall months. Yep. And then to end, uh, what we're going to talk about in our next few videos over the next several months is being ready, uh, being ready for what's coming in our uh, real estate market in the winter um, in next spring, you know, throughout 2022. So uh, stay tuned for some of those videos and it can be very informative if you want to talk about uh, what it means to be ready. Um, sooner than that, give us a call. We'd love to um, kind of strategize on what, we, what we're talking about with being ready for what's coming. Thanks for watching our video today. If you ever have any questions we can answer, give us a call or send us an email. Have a great day.